Hello friends, I'm Ellie, welcome to Cardboard Design. Today, I'm going to build a special house for the bunnies with a two-story bed and a double bathtub. Wow. Let's see how I do it. prepared these large pieces of cardboard here. I'll assemble them and secure them with glue to ensure a sturdy house frame. Then, I'll add colored paper to complete the frame. This house has many rooms, so I'll need a lot of colored paper for it. There, it's done! We'll start with the bedroom. I have a sheet of cardboard here and I'll turn it into a bed frame. It will have a special carrot design. I'll cut it out of the cardboard and smooth the edges. Cover it with orange paper all around. This is its leaf. Make sure not to miss any parts. Decorate it with sparkling gemstones. This sheet will be used for the bed's body. I'll cover it with pink paper and add orange trim. Place it inside the room. On top, I'll make a mattress. I'll stuff it with lots of cotton and wrap it carefully with fabric. Make sure to glue them together securely. Cut away any excess fabric. Don't forget to decorate it with ribbons and gemstones. Add another layer for this bed. It will be made the same way. I have some clay here. And I'll make cute bunny shaped pillows with it. Add two ears. This is its carrot. Complete the remaining details. Make it look even cuter. Place it on the bed. Assemble the remaining details of the bed. We'll need some stairs to get up there. I'll recycle some straws to make them. Assemble them, and we're done. Place them here. I think we need a small cabinet to store items. I'll make one from these small pieces of cardboard. After covering it with pink paper, I'll add two drawers. Decorate it with rhinestone strings for extra charm. It also needs two ears to look cuter. a flower. Install it in the cabinet and place it inside the house. Moving on to the next room. I have these long pieces of cardboard and I'm assembling them to create a TV stand. It will be covered with yellow paper. We're not done yet. I still need to add some other parts. Assemble them. Add small drawers. There, it's done. Place it in the room. Next, we'll make a special TV. I have an idea for it. I'll use some clay. Roll it out to lengthen it. Then, wrap it around this TV shape. Add a white circle. You'll soon find out what it's used for. Add two legs. Here are its ears. 
assemble them, and other details. Now, we have a special TV with a bunny on top. It looks really cute. Add two legs and place it here. We can't forget the speakers. I'll make them from smaller pieces of cardboard. Cover them carefully with colored paper. With this pop-it piece, Cutting it into small parts. I've got the speaker membrane. I'm sure we'll need a large sofa to have enough seating. And here it is. The sofa's legs will be made from simple available materials. Another important part is the cushion. You'll want it to be really soft. I'll stuff a lot of cotton on this small cardboard piece. Cut off the excess fabric. And don't forget it also needs to be decorated with gemstones. Assemble them together. And let's see the final result. There, we've completed the second room. We'll need to create some stairs to move between the floors. Assemble these cardboard pieces and secure them with glue. Each step will have a different color. Arrange them inside the house. Don't forget to decorate them with gemstones to make them shine. I'm making a new kitchen, including a microwave and cabinet system. Cover it with pink paper. Cut small cotton swaps for the handles. Attach them. Add small drawers. Place it inside. The upper part will also include a sink. Cover it with faux stone paper to make it look more real. Recycle straws to make faucets. And two taps. I am making a gas stove from foam and steel wire. Place it on the table. This is the pot I use for cooking every day. I prepared a few cardboard pieces to make a water purifier. I think it's an essential item too. Cover it with white paper. Assemble the remaining parts. Place it inside the house. The faucet will be recycled from these straws. Wait a moment while I make a glass. And then we'll see if it works well. It's perfect. Outside, we'll need a dining table. I'll make it quickly. Wait for a moment. The table legs will also be recycled from old straws. So it's done. Lay down a rug and place it on top. I'll make some chairs from clay. Flatten this clay. Then cut apart from the inside. Edge it with white clay. Add two ears and a tail. The chair legs will be made from recycled bottle caps. Decorate them with ribbons. Wow! There you have it. They look really cute. Let's try the microwave. It looks delicious. So, this room is complete.
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have the frame of the bathtub. Cover it with more colored paper. Put it here. I'll use this soda can to hold water in the tub. But first, let me enjoy it. <sighs> Cut it in half. Place it inside the bathtub. The other side too. Add two faucets and pour water in. Everything is done. Let's take another look at the house. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more videos. Goodbye and see you.